In this video, we will talk about the element of R called space. Space is the element which refers to the emptiness or area around, between, above, below, or within objects. This is what defines shape and form. We break space up into two different categories. It can either be positive or negative space. Positive space, aka the figure or the subject of a work of art, or negative space, the ground or area around the subject of a work of art. When creating the illusion of depth in two-dimensional artwork, there are a couple of terms that are important to know. First is the picture plane. This is the entire area of a work of art. The whole piece, all of the different layers and grounds represent the picture plane. The ground or area that is closest to the viewer is called the foreground. The area that is in between the farthest and the closest is called the middle ground. And the area farthest away from the viewer is called the background. There are several different type of perspective illusions that can also create a sense of realistic space on a flat artwork. Perspective is a graphic system that creates the illusion of depth and space on a two-dimensional surface. We can talk about atmospheric perspective, which is the use of color and details that get hazy or fuzzier and less bright and vibrant as they go towards the horizon line. This is based on the techniques that your eye uses to perceive the world around you. We can also talk about one-point perspective, where there is one vanishing point on the horizon that all parallel lines disappear to. We practiced this last year in seventh grade. In eighth grade, we will be working with two-point perspective, meaning that there are two vanishing points on the horizon line. So instead of looking at the front face of an object, we are now looking at the edge or a corner and describing it in more detail.